I just got home from Aldi and wow. <laughs> I actually had to sit down and take a break after carrying all this in. Excuse the ladder over here if we were working on some things. So anyhow, I finally brought everything in. It wouldn't even fit on all my on my table. I have some in the chair over here. I've got some in the chair over here. So yes, I'm going to share with you guys what I bought. Understand I have not been like, I think it's been at least two weeks since I've been to Aldi anyways. Um... The last time I went to the store, it was Walmart, and I bought a few things because my parents were coming in, and then we went on our trip to Morgantown, and so I didn't need much in the way of groceries, so I didn't buy much, and we have been living on what we had in the house, and now um, I just had to do a restock, so a lot of this stuff you're going to see is a lot of baking stuff. I decided this month would be a good month to stock up on some things uh, for the pantry because I'll be doing some holiday baking soon and Thanksgiving and Christmas. And it's really hard to believe that we're right around the corner from all that. But I want to buy while I can. So that's what I decided to do. I'm going to show you guys real quickly. Well, as quick as... I can <laughs> to show you guys what I bought. So I did stock up, like I said, on some baking items. So I have two all-purpose flours, two sugars. I also bought some almond bark. I bought the almond bark in the chocolate. Um, also bought some milk chocolate chips, as well as some white almond uh, bark right here. Two things of brown sugar. Um, also got a olive oil. I found this today. It sounded good. It's hot cocoa, but it's with pumpkin spice. And it's the K-cups for my Keurig machine. Thought I might use that. Sounded good. I love pumpkin. And I also bought the pumpkin spice coffee that they have. I just thought for something nice, um, you know, a specific time. I think I hear my husband talking out on the porch. Um, we've got some apple straws. These sounded really good, and they're cinnamon apple, and I bought those. You can see I'm really in a fall fall mood <laughs> this round. I bought black tea. I make iced tea with this, but I also drink it hot, too, when I want tea. In fact, yesterday uh, evening, uh, Ron and I had hot tea made with that, and it's really good. And we just use a little bit of milk and some... Splenda in it. Also got these here, um, these here caramel apples that they had, um, you know, in their produce section. I'm not sure how good they're going to be, but they look pretty good to me, and I love stuff like that. Then I also got some bacon. I got some hot Italian sausage, some chicken tenderloins, some more hot sausage because I'm going to make some more. Um, potato and hot sausage soup, a giant thing of family uh, ground beef. This is my favorite candy in the whole world, and every time I go to Aldi, I buy me a couple packs of this, and it does not last long. <laughs> um, I probably need to get out of the habit of getting it because I can't resist it. I absolutely love the flavors, and Ronnie don't care for it too much, so I don't have to fight anybody for it in the house, but I love it. Two things of Pringles, which I think one of mine might have got a little smushied um, coming home. Um, let's see, two things of the active dry yeast because I use this in my bread machine or when I make pizza dough and I've kind of been running low on it. Some sour cream, some cottage cheese, uh, some mayonnaise. Um, this one is um, a yellow mustard. I was trying to find the front. There we go, yellow mustard. Some... Sweet Baby Ray's uh, barbecue sauce. Three things of the mushroom spaghetti sauce. I use it for everything. Absolutely love it. It's kind of hard to find, so it's hit and miss when you go to the store to get it. Um, but I love it. Okay, so let's see here. We got three boxes of the chicken rice. If you guys know, I make broccoli casserole with this. It comes out really good every time. Got a little bit of granola because I've got some yogurt that needs to be utilized. It's already in my fridge. 
two things of the sweetened condensed milk. I use that in my pumpkin pie. I'm going to give this a whirl. This is the cold brew coffee. This is the mocha. Uh, let me know if you guys have tried it. I'm going to try it for coffee on the go. Also got some red pepper flakes because I love this on my pizza and I've been missing it every time I make pizza. A head of broccoli. Several things of taco seasoning as well as brown gravy mix. Two things of the imperial butter. Two things of their brand um, cream cheese. Also got two packs of the pepper jack cheese. Love this stuff. And a small bag of the taco style uh, shredded cheese. I'm going to pick up some more later. Um, we've got some sliced ham. Two bottles of vegetable oil. And we've got a whole milk, some onions. And over here we have three things of black beans. Also bought two things of their brand of Spam. My husband loves this with eggs. Um, okay, I'm trying. If you hear me scooting things, it's because i got to get in here so I can show it to you. Um, let's see what else we got here. Um, a thing of black olives. Absolutely love these. I put them in my egg salad. Two cans of pumpkin puree. Two things of... Um, coconut, shredded coconut to go in my baker stuff. Um, are these kidney beans? These are black beans too. I also got kidney beans. I also got uh, pink salmon. I got four of those. Two things of the sardines and hot sauce. Three things of tomato soup because I just like tomato soup by itself. Also got a uh, crushed and diced tomato. Two things of pineapple slices. Oh, let's see. We'll get it in there, won't we? A thing of pickles. I'm not sure if I showed that or not. I don't think I did. A thing of white bread right there. Now, down here, we got two things of the flour tortillas for breakfast um, burritos. Finally found my all-time favorite um seltzer water and i was like i gotta get this tonight <laughs> so i bought two cases this is the coconut that's my favorite it's hard to find i also got two boxes of the taco shells right here because we love our tacos a dozen eggs a 10 pound bag of russet potatoes and a bag of Fuji apples, which I absolutely love and will not be able to stay out of because I just love them. And that is it. Now I got to put all of this away. <laughs> and uh, so we'll be eating good this week. I hope you guys are doing fantastic. Hope you guys enjoyed seeing my haul. I love Aldi. I feel like I get a lot for my money when I go there. I don't feel this way when I go to other stores, but Aldi never lets me down. It just seems like I always come home with um, a lot of food to fill up the pantry and fridge and a freezer, and I love that. So I didn't buy a lot of freezer food this time. They didn't really have much um, that interests me this time around, but uh, definitely stocked up on a lot of baking. I've got the essentials, and I did get a lot of meat, so we're going to be eating. Hit that subscribe button. I'd love to have you part of Heidi's home, and I will be talking to you all again soon. So let me know what recipes are you making this fall. Is there anything new that you guys are making? I've been making a lot of soup lately, so just let me know what you guys are eating. I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye, guys.